Force Two carrying Vice President Mike Pence is scheduled to land at Lancaster Airport a little after 11 Thursday morning. He's here to raise money and drum up votes and enthusiasm in this battleground state and critical region of the Susquehanna Valley. Pennsylvania is a swing state that the Trump-Pence campaign won by less than 45,000 votes in 2016. They carried Lancaster County by 19 points. Republicans believe enthusiasm is on their side again in 2020. I will say four months before the election, having hundreds of people come through our door to volunteer. I I've never seen this level of excitement in the county. Recent polls show President Trump lagging behind Joe Biden in Pennsylvania and nationally. Biden visited Lancaster City just a couple of weeks ago. I asked Senator Pat Toomey how concerned Republicans are about the race and numbers. He believes the president should focus on the numbers having to do with the economy. The economy is coming back and that's very, that means people are getting back to work. That means they're able to provide for their families. That means they're able to have the confidence to go out and buy the things that they need. So I think that's very constructive. We went through a terrible, tough spell, and we're not out of the woods, but I think we're moving in the right direction. From here, the vice president will travel by bus to an economic roundtable discussion at a Chester County wireless technology business. Then he'll head to Philadelphia to meet with police officers and their families. In Lancaster County, Barbara Barr, WGAL. News 8.